these are installation instructions for cab number 40371 for John Deere 2032R and 2038R 2017 and up with fuel fill on left fender tractors. Step 1, see figure 1. Use the parts list and figure 1 to identify the steel parts. Step 2, see figure 2. Install right and left feet 1 and 2 and foot pocket guards 3. A. Pull back the rubber mat on models so equipped. Remove the bolts at reference A. Place two 5 8 by quarter inch spacers over the holes. Place a foot on the step plate as shown. Insert a 10 millimeter by 70 millimeter bolt down through the holes. Add the flat washers that were under the step plate and replace the removed nuts. Do not tighten at this time. B. Remove the bolt at reference B and leave the washer in place. Insert an M6 by 35 millimeter bolt into the foot pocket guard hole. Place a 5 8 by half inch spacer over the bolt. Insert the bolt. Do not tighten at this time. Repeat the above steps on the left side. Step 3, see figure 3. Install front posts 4, front crossbar 5. Insert a quarter by three quarter bolt outward through the lower hole in the post, the lower hole in the foot. Add the foot pocket guard and a nut. Do not tighten at this time. See inset. B. Insert a bolt out through the upper hole in the foot and post. Place a door hinge from the door hardware package over the bolt and add a nut. Do not tighten at this time. See inset. C. Repeat the above steps on the left side with the other post. Insert two bolts forward through the ends of the front crossbar and then the tabs welded to the front posts. Add lock nuts. Do not tighten at this time. Step 4, see figure 4. Install right and left rear post brackets 6 and 7, right and left rear posts 8 and 9, and rear corner posts 10. A. Remove the bolts holding the caution lights in place. Place the rear post brackets in position on the ROPs. Insert the bolts through the holes in the brackets and the ROPs. Thread the bolts into the lights. Do not tighten at this time. C. Use a bolt and nut to attach the corner post to the bracket with the bent upper end forward. Do not tighten bolts at this time. B. Use a bolt and nut to attach the right and left rear posts to the bracket. Note, when rear 
posts are properly installed, latch plates will be to the front with the notch to the outside of the enclosure. Step 5, see figure 5. Install right and left rear boxing posts 11 and 12. A. Remove the bolts at reference C. Place a 5 8 by quarter inch spacer over the holes. Place the bent ends of the right and left rear boxing posts over the holes at reference C. B. Insert an M6 by 35 millimeter bolt down through the holes. Replace the nuts. Do not tighten at this time. Step 6, see figure 6. Install top frame 14. A. Place the top frame onto the bent ends of the posts and insert 6 bolts upwards and add nuts. Do not tighten at this time. Step 7, C Figure 7. A. Place the U-clamps of the ROPS bracket open into the rear over the ROPS bars. B. Insert a 3 8 by 1 inch bolt up through the hole in the right ROPS bracket and then the slotted tab at the rear of the top frame. Slotted tabs up. Place a 3 8 flat washer over the bolt and add a 3 8 lock nut. Do not tighten at this time. Insert a quarter by three and a quarter inch bolt through the clamp. Add a nut. Do not tighten at this time. Insert one end of the rear curtain support over a clamp bolt to hold it in place. Place the other end in position against the nut. Turn the bolt in to hold it in place. Note. You may have to tighten one of the U-clamp bolts to get the ends of both bolts inside the rear curtain support 13. Install door bottoms. See figure 3. Insert two quarter by half inch bolts into the holes in the lower door frame with the heads against the vinyl. Place the door bottom over the holes, add lock nuts, and tighten. Close the snap flaps and or the velcro strips around the rod. Install door latches. This will require the 3 30 seconds Allen wrench. See figure 1. Loosen the set screws in the collar welded to the door and pull the rod out. Slide a spring to over the rod to the stop. Slide a door latch 1 onto the rod, reinsert the rod into the collar, tap 
lightly to seat the rod and then tighten the set screws. Note, the vinyl grip goes to the outside with the hook to the inside. Step 8, C Figure 8. Install the doors for frame door alignment. Install, close, and latch both doors. Tighten all bolts from previous steps at this time. Remove the doors by lifting the door up and out of the bottom hinge, then lowering out of the top hinge. E. Place a notched plastic protector over the bent ends of each rear post. C. Inset. Step 9. C. Figure 9. Install rear curtain 21. A. Close the hook and loop flaps around the top frame at the back and sides. Note, the ROPS remains outside of the rear curtain. B. Fit the vinyl around the rear boxing posts and rear corner posts. C. Close the hook and loop flaps around the rear post.
put the spring at the bottom of the rear curtain into the tractor frame. Step 10, see figure 10. Install front panel vinyl 22. A. Lay the rod sewn into the top of the front panel vinyl over the front crossbar. Close the hook and loop flaps around the front posts. B. Fit the vinyl around the foot pocket guards and secure the hook and loop tabs together. C. Hook the springs under the step plates on the right and left sides. Be careful to avoid moving parts. Note: The window on the right side of the front panel vinyl can be pulled open from the top down to use the hydraulic quick connect handle. Step 11, C figure 11. Install windshield 24 and plastic top 23. A. Place the plastic top onto the top frame and align the bolt holes. Place the lower edge of the windshield on top of the front panel vinyl and front cr panel crossbar, trapping the vinyl in place. Raise the front of the top and push the windshield back against the frame. Lower the top over the top edge of the windshield, trapping it in place. Insert four bolts with quarter inch flat washers through the top and the top frame tabs. Add lock nuts and tighten. G. Reinstall the doors. Attach the hook and loop fastener of the front panel vinyl to the doors. Install the windshield wiper per the instructions in the package.